Let's make a simple, quick and a very flavorful rice. Hello dear friends and welcome to Kitchen Compass. I have cooked and kept aside 500 grams of rice. For a better flavor, this rice has been cooked in vegetable stock and salt as needed for the rice. I have taken 500 grams of boneless chicken, cut into bite-sized pieces and marinated it for half an hour with 1 teaspoon of rice vinegar, 1 teaspoon soya sauce, 1 teaspoon pepper powder and half teaspoon of salt. I have also finely chopped 5 to 6 bird's eye chilies, 1 teaspoon of garlic, 2 tablespoons of ginger and 1 medium sized onion. I have also taken about 1 cup of chopped carrots and also chopped 3 medium sized bok choy keeping the stem and green separately. This is rehydrated and chopped shiitake mushrooms. I have rehydrated it by soaking it in hot water for 20 minutes. I have also taken about 1 fourth cup of basil leaves. Heat a pan and add 2 tablespoons of sesame oil or any oil of choice. Once the oil is hot, add in the garlic and half of the chopped chilies and saute for 1 to 2 minutes. Add in the marinated chicken and cook it on a medium high flame until the chicken is cooked. The chicken is cooked now. Add in the mushrooms and saute it well. Check for seasoning and add accordingly if needed. I am adding 1 teaspoon of soya sauce. Continue to saute it until it is a little browned. The chicken and mushrooms are sauteed well. Transfer it to a bowl. Into the same pan, add in another 2 tablespoons of oil. Add in the ginger and the remaining chilies and saute it. Now add in the onions and a little salt and saute it until the onions are a little brown. Add in the stem part of the bok choy and the carrots and saute on a medium high flame for 3 to 4 minutes. Add in the bok choy leaves and saute for a minute. Add in 1 teaspoon of soya sauce. Now add in the sauteed and kept aside chicken and mushrooms and mix everything well. Check for seasoning and flavors and add accordingly if required. Transfer this mix into the rice and mix well and saute for 2 to 3 minutes. Add 2 teaspoons of vinegar. Now 
garnish with chopped basil leaves. The simple and delicious rice is ready to be served. Do try this recipe and thanks for watching.